Time to take things seriously. <laughs> very, very seriously. <laughs> What's going on everyone? This is Dom and today we're talking about the best cases and accessories for the iPhone XR. And a huge shout out to ESR, Ghost Tech, and Optima for supporting the channel. So first up, we have a couple of cases from ESR here, and these are two different styles actually. We have a clear one and a black one, as you can see. Now the cool thing here about the clear case from ESR is the fact that the backside is actually tempered glass. So we have glass on the back here, which actually goes perfectly with the iPhone XR if we just pop that on there. The, the benefit here is that you have something that really shows the actual color of the device right through that tempered glass back cover. And you have the same kind of feeling in the hand too, if you know what I mean. I mean, you really get across the point of having a blue or a red or orange or all the different colored phones that Apple is making. And it has a pretty substantial bumper around the side for added drop protection. I definitely think this case is a win for sure. And if you wanna find out more about it or anything else I mentioned in this video, I will leave links below for you. Now this next case from ESR is going to be more of a protective style. And so if we pop that on here, you can see, well, first off, we have a nice little kickstand so you can kind of set it up in either orientation and be able to watch videos or things like that. And it just folds back into the backside as you can see there. But it's nice and protective, right? It's, it's actually quite thick. It adds a little bit of bulk to the phone, but if you want that added drop protection, you're really not gonna find that with like a thin transparent case, especially one that has tempered glass in the back, but I still think this is my favorite from them so far. You can't go wrong with, especially if you like to watch movies and stuff on the go, you can just prop that guy up, stand it like so, and you're all set and ready. So next up, we are talking about Ghost Tech and they're huge friends and supporters of the channel here. So big shout out to them. They have a couple of cases here for the iPhone XR and one of them is the Nautical 2 and then we have the Exec 3. So first up with the Nautical 2, this is actually kind of cool. So you do get added protection with this case, but you also bump your iPhone XR up to an IP rating of IP68, since this guy right here is only IP67 certified. And on top of that, this does have a built-in screen protector. So as you can see, if I just pop this guy on here, and turn on the flashlight in the process, we can go ahead and get this all sealed and secured by just pinching around the sides of it. And there you go, you're good to go with an IP68 rating. And it actually fits it kind of nice. So you can still see the color of the phone through the back. It does add some thickness, obviously being a nice protective case like this. But you do have a built-in screen protector here as well, which is just kind of you know resting on the top. And overall, this isn't gonna affect any wireless charging capabilities or any phone calls. And the screen seems very touch sensitive. So you really don't have anything to worry about with this. I actually like this a lot because like I said, it definitely doubles down on the waterproofing of this device, and that's definitely a win. Now with the Exec 3 here, we do have a pretty unique take on the standard wallet case, and it's actually kind of cool. So if you open this flap up right here on the back, which is held in place by a magnet, we can go ahead and insert the phone. So you do have kind of some on the table protection if you wanna put this down. It'll protect your screen from actually touching the surface of a table, which is nice. But under that flap, we have our card pockets. So you can actually fit a few cards inside of this little pocket right here and then be able to flip it over and you have everything kind of secured in one place, which I think is pretty cool. Just flip open the flap stick your cards in, close it, and you're good to go. And like I said, you got that lay on the table protection. So next up, we're checking out an accessory. And of course, it's no surprise that the iPhone XR has no headphone jack, just like you know the previous iterations of the iPhones for the last two or three years. But we have a nice, affordable Bluetooth headset here. This is actually from Optima, and this is the B Live. Two. And these things are actually pretty nice. So the housing here is actually made of metal and it feels very premium. They got a nice weight to them, but they're not gonna fall out or anything if you're running, at least for me they didn't. I guess it depends on the size of your ear. But to address that, we do also have ear tips included in the box, as well as a charging cable here to charge these bad boys up. Now, along with all that, these guys do kind of clip together via a magnet on the back. So when you have them around your head here, 
You can just clip them together and they'll hang there like a pretty fancy necklace. On top of that, they do have 10 hour battery life. And I think that these things are pretty good overall. I mean, I'm, I'm definitely a fan of Optima headphones, but these guys are pretty nice. Like I said, they connect via Bluetooth. They have a 10 hour battery life and they're just made out of premium materials. I mean, this metal feeling right here is very nice. They're constructed very well and they're only about 50 bucks. So I'll leave a link to them below if you wanna check them out. Next up, we're talking about a way to protect your screen because, well, that's pretty important too when it comes to a smartphone. And we're checking out the Griffin Survivor Glass. And I like how a lot of these companies are now including little applicators to put the screen protector on. And it's actually pretty easy to do. If we just wipe this guy off, you just put this guy on top of the phone, just like that, and you're ready to apply the screen protector. You just peel off the back, line it up with the little thing, and boom, you're good to go, just like that. Just give it a nice little press, and everything's all set. I really like how easy they make it to put screen protectors on devices now, and everything is all set to go. Now, if you're looking for some fast charging, there are a ton of options out there, but from Apple, they do offer some, which are a little more expensive than others. But if you want to fast charge your iPhone XR, you're gonna need to pick up this USB type C 30 watt power adapter and the USB type C to lightning cable right here. And that will allow you to fast charge this device. Unfortunately, they don't include it in the box, but you do have this option and several others, which I will leave linked in the description. So let's talk about wireless charging for a second, because we do have that supported here on the iPhone XR. And one of my favorite battery packs is the PowerStation Wireless XL. Now, this thing is cool because yes, it's just your typical USB power bank, you know, from the outside, but we can actually enable this, go ahead and set the phone on top of it, and it'll start charging up the device, which is pretty freaking cool for a battery pack. So not only do you have a USB port here on the bottom, you can charge it with a cable, but you can also just set this thing on your desk, set the phone on top of it, and start charging your device like that. Pretty cool stuff here for Mophie. I actually really like this guy a lot. It's nice to throw in the backpack because, well, it's pretty portable. But if you're looking for something a little more secured to your desk or your nightstand, definitely wanna check out this wireless charging stand from Taurus. Now I covered Taurus uh, cases in my last iPhone accessories video, but this one is pretty nice. As you can see, it's a very thin wireless charger. We have this nice fabric-y texture on the top here. And overall, it's gonna work just the same. You're gonna plug it in via the included cable here, set your phone on top of it, and begin charging. So next up, we are talking about clear cases because, well, with all the wild colors that Apple is releasing of the iPhone XR, if you pick one up, you're probably gonna wanna show off that color because, well, why would you get a nice colored phone as opposed to like a black one or something if you're not gonna show it off. And first up, we're gonna talk about the OtterBox View series. And well, they call it the View series because you get a nice view of the phone on the inside. And I actually like this guy a lot. It's got a pretty cool looking texture on it here. As you can see, we just got like a, a nice little texture. It's actually on the inside of the case. So it's going to add a little bit of uh, shock absorbent to the case if you happen to drop it. It's not making like direct, like flat contact with the ground or anything like that. And we do have a nice little lip around the side here that will give you some corner protection, a nice little bumper, I guess you call it. And this is actually one of the only cases that was available at the Apple store for the iPhone XR, which is weird because Apple usually releases their own cases, but I don't know. Nonetheless, the OtterBox View series is definitely a go. Next up, we're talking about the Griffin Strong Clear Case, and they do have a regular version of this as well, but this is the more durable one. Now, this case is very, very rigid, so once you put your phone in there, you're actually getting some pretty decent protection as well as some added thick boyness on the side there. You can see it does add a little bit of bulk to the phone, but that's not necessarily a bad thing, especially if you want a clear case that's going to add a ton of protection to your device. This is probably one of the only places that you're going to get like this thick of a clear case to show off the color and to keep your flashlight on if that's what you're gonna do. Next up, we do have the Incipio NGP, and this guy's pretty simple. It's a nice silicone like floppy style case, which I actually like the feeling of but we do have a nice little frosted part here at the bottom which does give it a cool look and then we have clear up at the top so you can be able to see you know all of the color and all the details of the iPhone behind that but this little frosted like 
bottom third is actually pretty cool. The case doesn't add a ton of bulk to the phone, as you can see, just a little bit there. We do have a nice little raised lip so you can put the guy flat down on the table without having to worry about scratching your screen. And overall, I mean, this is a very simple case from Incipio, but it's a nice clear one nonetheless. Now, finally, wrapping up the clear case department, we have the Veil XT from Kadabe. And Kadabe has been a supporter of the channel for a while, and I genuinely love this case to death. I did a video on it a long time ago. It got a crazy amount of views for some reason, but this is like one of the thinnest cases for an iPhone that you can get. And this guy is pretty Pretty cool looking because it's got a nice frosty look it makes the whole phone look different and look at that i mean it really doesn't even seem like you have a case on the phone at all it's so freaking thin and has perfect cutouts for like everything on the phone i like this case a lot it's not going to add a ton of protection to your device but that is not the point the point is obviously you're going to protect from scratches on the back side but you have a nice minimalist type of protection for the phone. It's not going to stand up if you throw it across a room or anything like that, so don't do that. But this guy right here is definitely a win all around based on its pure thinness on the device. And this cool frosted look is pretty nice as well. Now here we have one of my favorite cases from Incipio. This is the Esquire series, and it's pretty simple in the terms that it's just a case that covers up your phone. It adds some protection against drops and stuff, but I really like this kind of denim-y like fabric material on the back. It just has a nice premium look and feel. Now, of course, if you're trying to show off the color of your phone, this is not going to do that for you, but it is a very nice case nonetheless, and everything seems to fit pretty perfect on here. The Esquire series, one of my favorite cases from Incipio. Definitely go ahead and check that out using the link below. Now, finally, we have a wallet, and you're probably wondering, how does this have anything to do with an iPhone accessory? Well, this is the Slim Wallet from Nomad, and as you can see, it has tile tracking. So inside of this guy, in this pocket here, there's a little tile tracker. And if you're not familiar with what that is, well, I have it actually in my previous wallet. If you lose your wallet, it is amazing. Check this out. All I have to do is press the find button and... Enough of that. Anyway, it's pretty cool because it'll ring your wallet and allow you to find it wherever you are in your house. Cause I lose my wallet all the time. It's under the bed, it's in the couch. I left it in the office, blah, blah, blah. And this wallet's nice too. It's pretty premium material. I mean, there's Horween leather on here and it connects to your phone via Bluetooth with that little tile that's inside of here. And when the tile runs out, you can actually remove it and be able to replace it as well. So it just comes out, it's a nice little flat, thin square that goes in there. You can stick it back in. So all you do is download the Tile app, activate the tile in the wallet, and you're good to go. And like I said, these tiles are amazing, especially if you lose stuff like I do. So that about wraps it up for this video on the iPhone 10R cases and accessories. And I hope you enjoyed all of these. I've been spending the last couple of weeks tracking things down as best I could for this phone and giving them a try and everything like that. So I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know what your favorite cases or accessories are for the iPhone XR or any phone that you have. Just leave them in the comment section below. I'm curious to know your thoughts. And I'm a big fan of this phone. I think this is a sleeper phone that a lot of people are gonna realize is actually a lot better than it seems kind of later on down the road. But let me know what you think about the 10R. Leave this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and subscribe for more videos like this in the future. Thank you so much for watching everyone. This is Dom and I'll catch you in the next video.